credit scene where we see Kane now a free man of all his obligations of the high table with flowers in hand and excited to see his daughter only for Akira to finding him and approaching Kane with a knife seeking her vengeance for her father's death. Now something this film did beautifully to me was showing the various characters dealing with not only legacy, the various different fathers and daughters and their relationships and seeing the fathers being killed and having their daughters like Akira seeking out vengeance for losing her dad and the same thing could be said about Hadia who lost her father and had vengeance by sending John Wick to killing his killer. So now the question is, did Akira manage to kill Kane or did he manage to stop her? And we might see a spinoff in which she's going to be on a hunt to killing Kane, but also might want to take out the high table for ultimately being the ones who sent Marquis in the position of killing her father in the first place. I really enjoyed both of those characters and I personally wouldn't mind seeing more of them in the future.